What's up, guys? So, as you may or may not know, um, Iggy is back. Iggy Azalea has a new song. It's called Savior. It features Quavo. And I just got done listening to the song, watching the video, and I don't think it's that good. That's just me personally. That's my opinion. I don't think it's a good song. And I tend to be in the majority, or uh, at least close to it. So I wanted to test and see how close I was to the general consensus about this song. So I decided to uh, go to YouTube, look up the song, and see what the scores were about it. Uh, and by score, I mean the ratio of likes to dislike. So I thought that it would be around 10 to 3. For every 10 likes, you got 3 dislikes, or so 30%, which I think is more than fair for it given the type of uh, the song that it is and the quality. But when I actually check, it's actually 10 to 1. Less than 10 to 1. Which I just thought was crazy. So, I wondered about the comments and who was commenting on this song and what they were saying. So, it has over 7,000 comments and people are saying like, Iggy is better than ever in this song. And... This is the best song as a writer. This is her best song as a writer. I just want to hear her freestyle again. Nice video. So I'm looking at these people. And it's just weird that every single one of these comments have likes. So if I'm sorting by top comment, that's going to be right. But... Let's go to new comment. So all these people seconds ago are just writing, right? Awesome job. Good work on the tune. I have mixed feelings. That's... Now, let's look at the people that say the bad things about it. I have mixed feelings. So let's bring him up. Well, her. Sorry. She's got eight subscribers. She has mixed feelings, right? But let's bring up one of these random names. And usually they're like just weird names. Like Lascado. Let's see how many subscribers Lascado has. Oh, Lascado actually has a lot of subscribers. <laughs> so Lascado's pretty big. But let's look at. Uh, Richard Lucas. Richard Lucas has a playlist. No subscribers. Let's see. What about Matthewis Vitor. Let's see what his angle is. He's got a playlist. No subscribers. Let's be honest, this isn't that good. I bet you that's a real person. Jesus Christ is Savior. Bet you that's face. She is Christina Rebello. And what's with all these like Latin people uh liking the song? Am I missing something? Is she Latin? Iggy. Christina's got one subscriber. But if you go through these comments, you will find a lot of people. And what I see is a lot of these people. I said, I'm not trying to hate. This channel doesn't have any content. A lot of these people don't really have a presence it's almost like they were created just so they could make comments not saying that they're bots i don't know if they're bots or not but a lot of these people are making these comments and how can somebody be so these aren't normal comments that people would make so i'm not saying that they are robots but a girl as hot as Anna Sophia would definitely have more than one subscriber. I'm sorry. I'm not saying that she's going around buying.
comments or paying for people to, you know, talk on her page or pay for likes. But these people just don't seem very active. I'm sorry. And they seem very Latin. All of them. He's got four subscribers. Four years ago, he posted a video. That's pretty much his last activity online. But he came back to tell Iggy Azalea, Rogue by Lando. Now check out this one that says the wannabe. No subscribers anywhere. How to blow on your YouTube. Come up with a catchy hook. Make me go sing. Any bets whether this is a real guy or not? <laughs> it's pretty crazy. So guys, um, uh, I don't know how to feel about these comments. I don't know how to feel about the song. Well, I definitely know how about the song. The song sucks. But the comments and the likes and even the views, I don't know. Just something smells off to me. It gives hell you. Try again. I need you guys to subscribe to me so I can keep exposing the truth. Keep bringing the real music to you that you love. See you later.